wanted to do this for a while. Um, it's actually uh, been quite good timing as well because three of them can have just come out with a, uh, a big update for their monitor and their steering kit. We're currently out drilling with it at the moment. Yeah, I wanted to give you sort of like an end of year review on it, how it's been for us and, uh, and stuff like that. They've also got this fancy new remote control that they've got for it as well, which is uh, pretty nice. Not the easiest on this job because I'm doing other things at the same time, but uh, yeah, everything. Uh... Just got to... We're just trying to get the last of the wheat in for our neighbour here. But um, yes, on the new update, it is, oh, they've done wonders with the app itself. This thing is just a different thing altogether. Everything that I sort of complained about in the previous videos or, or suggested to them, they fixed. Uh, the field management system's way better. The in data input is perfect. You can actually put all your data in there. Um, I actually can't find too many faults with it. There's only one fault I can find with it, and that's it. It just doesn't uh, show you, it's about two seconds behind on the screen to what you've actually done. That is the only fault I can uh, I can pick up with it. But uh, I've done all my drilling again this time with it. If the phone signals aren't brilliant, it will play you up. But if you've got good phone signals in your area, uh, it's, um, yeah, it's a great bit of kit. We've got one farm where the uh, signal isn't great, but it's still, and I mean when I say it's not great, it's terrible. But it still has got the job done. Another improvement is the uh, the button engagement. They've improved that. It was one of my biggest flaws with it. Uh, you can still trick it. You can still upset it. But uh, for the most part, it's ten times better. Whoever did the, the software behind this thing did a really nice job. Uh, yeah, and we've also got this uh, this handy dandy remote control. Uh, I can't. You know, it's, it's hard to do everything at once, but you can engage the steering on this thing. You can trim it to the left or right if you're uh, if you're a little bit one side or the other. You can put your A and B line in. Uh, you can do your metering. So we'll turn the metering off, look, and then we'll turn it back on, and it works instant. I was I was very dubious with this. I thought it was going to take. You know a few seconds to engage or blah 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 we'll um we'll see if we can do it with the remote in a second but everything i've done with that remote so far has been very good as if you're touching the screen yourself so let's just press the button look straight on down goes the drill yeah really impressive what they've done it feels like they've listened to me because uh, all of the complaints have now disappeared. It's a bit of a dream. They're also going to send me a, um, a Wi-Fi camera that will uh, it'll Wi-Fi direct to the screen. So we can have in our seed hopper a camera in there so we can see exactly what's going on in there and stuff like that. You know, you can have it on a machine or, or, or anything. You can have it put it on it anywhere. It's Wi-Fi so it will just it pings back to the screen and shows you what's going on there. Yeah, we've had it for a year. You know, we've been doing some testing with Sri Birkin to um, to get it to where it needs to be, and it's you know they've listened. Well, we go. We are uh, a bit tender this end, but. And the, um, also the other thing is, I've been uh, backwards and forwards with Sveerwerken. The after sales service is it's something you're not quite used to really. There's somebody there, they're answering your questions, they're, uh, they, you know, they're very, very helpful behind the scenes as well. If you need any help with anything, there's somebody there to talk to, there's someone there always ready to help. Yeah, these guys are on it, so. It's been, um, it's been a bit of, you know, it's been fine. It, it's not, you know, it's not like these John Deere systems where they're over complicated. This thing will, you know, I don't use it, but it will turn you, it'll turn back on itself. It will also, you've got to back the boundary of the field first. Uh, it will also do these funny shaped U-turn things 
Uh, I don't use them. I just want a straight line out of thing. That's all I want. I want a basic straight line and I want it to be accurate. And with the RTK SIM card, it is both of those things, it's accurate. I wasn't sure about the remote. They, uh, they said, we'll send you a remote. And I was like, yeah, well, you know, it's, I thought it might be a bit gimmick, gimmicky, but when you're on a job like topping or something like that, you know, you, you've only got to turn the wheel and click it in the other hand. Uh, you can mount this thing as well. You could, uh, it's got two mounting holes and they come with the screws. You can mount this wherever you might want it. I actually, I wouldn't mind it there, if I'm honest. Just so I could, uh, it's just everything's close to hand, but we'll see, we'll change that on another day. Gotta be careful what I'm doing here, I'm in the picks. And yeah, I just wanted to give you an update on it. The software is night and day. Night and day different. It's always a second behind, if you know what I mean. If they could get it, to refresh a little bit quicker that would be the dream you know to show me what it's doing as we're doing it that would be a dream i'll show you what i mean by that if you look at the screen i'm going to drop the drill down now this thing hasn't even said it's there yet now it's saying it's there look so it's it's a few seconds behind from where you actually are in the field but it does map it correctly uh, you know, it's not it's not as if it's missing bits or anything like that. It does map it correctly. It just it's just delayed by a couple of seconds. Uh, so I imagine with the next improvement, that'll be a thing. Alarms going off now. We'll come back in a minute. Very very easy to use. Literally, you can set up a straight line. If, if, if that's all you want out of it, is a straight line. You can set that up. All you have to do is put your width that you want, and you can set that up so fast it's ridiculous within 30 seconds you 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 literally you, <laughs> you just set your width up press a press b and you're away that's it that's all you have to do it'll mark it out it will uh, it'll show where you've been it's um it's just a very good bit of kit that makes older tractors very useful again me and farmer have always said it you're not you're not going to save millions of pounds of fuel um, but what you are going to save yourself is the um, tiredness at the end of the day. And uh, whoever you, uh, it, we we were very sceptical of GPS when it was uh, first came out. Farmer was farmer didn't want to know it at all. But now um, you know we wouldn't have we wouldn't we wouldn't do it without it it's just it just changes the way you do things you're not so tired at the end of the day you're not concentrating for so long you still got to be aware there are other little things that could come with it you know you, you, in my eyes you, you don't want to be sat playing with your phone or anything like that you've got to be aware that this thing um, is obviously driving you down the field there are poles sometimes there are obstacles in the field you know you still got to be quite aware but it's, it's just the uh, just saves you at the end of the day it, uh, and it is just noticeable once you've been on it and had a go with one you'll just be like what were we doing <laughs> so yeah we would have you know if I, if, yeah, if I could con the farmer out of another one I'd have it on my tractor but uh, it works really nice on here the accuracy is really good the, uh, you have to bear in mind you need a sim card the subscription is around five to six hundred pounds i believe in that sort of region uh, per year and that's the other cost that is on top but you can if you're doing you you know you can you can easily set it up to do uh, controlled wheelings next year i can save all this i can come back to it and literally redrill it as i've re as i've drilled it now uh, it's, and it is literally that accurate it is really good so Yes, I really like it anyway. I wouldn't, uh, I'd rather do it. I would much rather do it with it. Uh, the little remote there is, uh, it's a handy little thing actually. I quite like that. Um, we will find a place for it in this tractor. You will see us using it. Uh, we're coming to the end of field work for this year. So whether it, you know, be into next year before you see us using that, this might even be the last field work of the year. So, but the app is, Oh, it's just uh, yeah, the app's a dream. You know, they've been they've been working really hard on that. I can tell they have, and uh, it's where it wanted to be. You know, um, it's a good little system. I recommend it. 
if you lose signal it will do strange things like it will just suddenly turn the steering wheel on you I've had it happen you will see videos of it happening uh, when we are out and about drilling over at gyms for example that area is terrible for signal and it just doesn't like it I will I would ask the severe American people to uh, if it loses signal instead of instead of uh, spinning the steering wheel if we could just have it disengage that would be uh, that would be a way more comfier thing because uh, it will literally the, you don't get much warning the steering wheel just starts just just turns <laughs> but uh, what you know is that just comes with bad signal I'm afraid. I haven't used the curve line feature since they've updated this. Uh, we will use that in the spring, we'll see how it is. Good little bit of kit. We, we've used it every, every you know, there isn't a uh, time where somebody's been working, had the opportunity to use it and not used it. You know, everybody uses it. It's just, um, it's just a handy bit of kit. I will, uh, if they send us a camera to try, I will uh, we'll include that in another video down the road yes yeah, so the little things you know aftercare service that that is really you know in my experience with them any, anything I've wanted to know or any or help with they've been uh, on the other end of the phone uh, instantly so uh, I've never had trouble getting hold of them or anything like that they've been uh, they've been really good and the update they walk you through the updates to, to uh, get it to the latest software so yeah if you're on the old software I'd highly recommend contacting your uh, your local three of Urka man and um, getting them to uh, update it to the latest software because the latest software is just straight out. So there we go. That's all there is to it. Good bit of kit. Really enjoyed having it. Yeah, glad we got it. I'm just, uh, it's one of those things. <laughs> Wet, first time drilling last year and uh, look, it, <laughs> I don't know if just the planets aligned correctly and they, they sent us this thing <laughs> at the right time but it just um, yeah got me out of a jam because uh, without it I don't think I could uh, do it as well well I know I couldn't do it as well so there we go the uh, the most satisfying thing is the perfect straight rows it gives you you uh, you um, when you go cultivating you can like you can you can interlace the rows which means you do a row miss a row and then come back on yourself and it's perfect oh, I just yeah, it's just really nice. This remote's a handy little thing. We'll get this mounted somewhere. I don't know. We're going to think about a place to get that mounted. But um, yeah, pretty cool bit of kit. Anyway, we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.